The Optus project started in November 2014 and this is about language modeling and more specifically on getting robots to cooperate with humans by using language. The project has two main research objectives. The first one is to study and implement the learning of words associated to manipulation tasks in humanoid robots. And for our studies, manipulation tasks are modeled as hand actions performed on objects, eventually by using tools. And each action produces a certain effect. An example of manipulation task is the tapping of an object in order to move it over a certain distance. For example, if we want to move a toy car by tapping it, after a few trials, we realize that it's better to tap it either from the front or the rear. And we want to train the robot to take the same kind of decisions when manipulating objects. Other manipulation tasks require the usage of tools. Let's assume we want the robot to grasp an object, like for instance a toy octopus, but the octopus cannot be reached because it's too far. Then the robot can pick an octopus tool, like in this case the toy ray, and move the octopus close to his body and then it can finally grasp the object. In the Robotus project, along with the modeling of manipulation tasks, we are working at the learning of words that describe the entities involved in such tasks. The robot is expected to understand sentences like pull the octopus with the ray, and this involves to identify the role of each word in the sentence and associate the word to its corresponding entity that it can be either the object, the tool, the action, or the effect. The second objective of the Robotask project is to study the interaction of robots with humans while cooperating on manipulation tasks. And this study permits to investigate the problem of coordinating the behavior of humans and robots during cooperation by exchanging information through language. The model of language in robots is a fundamental problem, especially in social scenarios in which a robot, for example, can be a co-worker in housekeeping activities or a caregiver for aged people. In such scenarios, language can facilitate the interaction of co and cooperation of humans with robots. And this is due to the fact that natural language represents the most natural interface that a person can use to interact with robots. Robots capable of understanding language and adapt their behavior according to human requests can have an important impact in improving our daily lives.